story happened when I lived in Guyana a while ago. I had this client who was a lecturer at the University of Guyana. And she came to me to get her hair done. And she was telling me this story about three of her students. She said they had refused to take the, the final exam because it was slated for Saturday. And she was really mad about it because she said they had disrespected her. So I asked her, let me explain. I told her, I said, they were not disrespectful to you because this is the Sabbath we are talking about. The Sabbath is the Lord's Sabbath. It's not their Sabbath. So they would not do anything to offend God. They are pleasing God rather than man. And I told her, you know, I explained in more detail to her. When I was finished, she said, you know what? And I totally understand. I will go and I will give them their exam on Monday. And I turned to her and I said, those students were praying. I'm betting you that they were praying at this very moment. And God sent you here today for me to explain to you why they must have their exams on a different day. And it is not my doing, but it's the doing of the Holy Spirit who has allowed you to make the decision you just made. And with that, she went away and she came back next two weeks and she told me, guess what? They aced the exam, all three of them. And I was so happy because I remember God will make a way when there seem to be no way. And Luke 21, 15 says that you will be brought before kings and you will do whatever you do will be done as a testimony before God. That's my testimony. Thank you.